Today I'm going to show you how to install MHZ pleated Venetian honeycomb or Roman arrow blinds with a face mount bracket. Face mount brackets would be used in the case of a more narrow glazing bead. Let's get started. Step 1. Ensure you have all the necessary supplies to complete the installation. You will need a drill with a Phillips head 1 bit, ideally in a magnetic holder, a pencil or punch, scissors or snippers, your blinds package, and your installation manuals. Step 2. Carefully unwrap your blind from the plastic and ensure that the blue bag of mounting parts includes four glazing bead brackets, four screws, four plastic caps for your screws and brackets, and two handles. Step 3. Position your glazing bead mounting bracket at the face of the inner corner of the window frame, also called the glazing stop or bead. Step 4. Install the glazing bead mounting bracket from the blue bag with the screws provided. A magnetized drill bit really helps with this step. Drill where there are holes in your mounting bracket. Do this with all four brackets on all four corners of the window. Step 5. Take the plastic caps and slide them onto the uncovered side of the mounting bracket. Cover the screws with the small round plastic caps. Step 6. Carefully unwind the strings wrapped around one side of the blind. Run your finger in between both of the strings to check that everything is detangled. Twists in the string will inhibit the function of the blind. Step 7. Take some of the excess string sticking out from the clip's end and fold it back into the clip. Push the string in securely between the plastic lip and the clip so that it will not inhibit the clip's mounting abilities. This step allows for excess string in case the blind needs to be tightened or loosened later. Step 8. Slide and push the clip into the mounting bracket. You will hear a slight snapping sound if the clip has been properly inserted. Step 9. Mount the bottom clip. Again, slide and push the clip into the mounting bracket and wait for a snapping sound to make sure you have done it properly. Step 10. Repeat these steps with the clips on the other side of the window. You will only need to fold back excess string into the top clips, not the bottom clips. Step 11. With the MHZ logo facing upward, slide on both handles. Push these on until you hear a click. Step 12. Check the blind for proper string tension. Open the blind and make sure it runs smoothly up and down. Tap the top of the blind to make sure it's tight enough. If it maintains its position, it's good. Check for any other irregularities. Step 13. Cut off the excess string sticking out from the clips. Take care to not cut the strings running through the blind. Step 14. Double check to make sure the blind rails can clip into the brackets. After that, you're good to go. Emery said North America offers custom blinds to enhance your light, space, and life.